Hello, I'm Piers Corbyn from weatheraction.com, long range weather and climate forecasters. And today I'm going to give you a report of our November forecast and the advances we made in the solar lunar action technique of forecasting. Our November long range forecast said we'd have a mixed start with a notable storm with gales, deluges and flash floods early in the month and then we said there would be cold spells with some sleet and snow later on and the month would end with a mild and windy stormy uh, period. What actually happened was the first three weeks went excellently and we were congratulated uh, by many users for the forecast success. However, the end of the month, although it was very unsettled, was not mild at all. So we investigated what had happened and that led to a new advance in our solar lunar action technique from what we call 4B to now SLAT 5. And this is a very significant advance. And using that, we know we can identify when there are these sudden flips in uh, weather type. And with our renewed confidence of that, we decided we would make some explicit forecasts of likely errors that were going to take place in standard meteorology forecasts of the snow which was now happening. And we warned uh, uh, that in the period the 27th to 30th, especially the 28th, 29th, the snow would be much more severe than standard meteorology would be saying from a day or two ahead. And furthermore, it would even include uh, thunder uh, and, you know, some quite extreme conditions. And we said that anything the Met Office say on the 26th of November should be doubled in amount and look out for more winds and so forth on the 28th or 29th. The 28th and 29th came along and indeed uh, there was a lot more snow than they said and there was thunder in the snow, which is a rare thing, for certainly for the British Isles. Um, there was thunder... Thunder snow was reported in Scotland and, uh, and uh, yeah, North East England uh, on CNN uh, as it happened. The uh, journalists concerned were very excited and uh, so were we. Uh, the details of what happened, um, we had warned that this enhancement of uh, this extreme weather would take place both in Britain and in, in Europe and also in the USA. Uh, and what indeed turned out was there were major snow and blizzard disruption beyond the uh, expectations of standard meteorology. There was whiteout as we predicted, uh, there was thunder snow, and as we warned there was over a foot of snow in a number of places in Britain. Uh, there was massive uh, disruption in Europe and in America, where there were quite a lot of blizzards with thunderstorms. Our uh, success in predicting these enhancements of uh, standard meteorology has given us even more confidence in our issued forecast uh, for the essence of winter, which is a sponsored forecast to go to the public to help everyone know what is going to happen in the winter as a whole in Europe. And there's a separate video about this, and if you want more information, go to weatheraction.com. Thank you.